Improper nutrition is one of the causes of joint diseases. What should you eat to protect your joints? Before I start, I'd like to ask you to help get the first 1,000 subscribers on my channel. 99% of viewers watch my videos without a subscription. Please appreciate the work, subscribe to the channel, click on the bell, and don't forget to like it. In the future, I will delight in useful materials. It is well known that jelly-like and calcium-containing foods are essential for joint health. However, according to the recommendations of doctors, a special diet for the joint disease is far from being limited to the use of cottage cheese and jelly. The list of prohibited and recommended foods is much longer. Why is the right diet so important for joint disease? The health of the joints is affected, first of all, by the balance of microelements. For example, many people know that dairy products are good for joints and cartilage. However, for the absorption of casein, the stomach releases a lot of acids, and for balance, it is exactly the same calcium that creates an alkaline environment. Proper intake of carbohydrates, proteins, fats, vitamins, and minerals is important. It has been proven that the main cause of arthrosis is a violation of metabolic processes and cartilage tissues. In addition, the modern way of life of a person is far from ideal, we sit a lot, move little, carry heavy loads, and have bad habits. All this negatively affects the condition of the joints. Therefore, in combination with moderate exercise, you need to eat healthy foods for bones and joints. To understand the disease, I'll tell you a little about them. Rheumatoid arthritis is often triggered by immune disorders. In this case, the use of fish oil is very useful. In addition to pharmacy capsules, omega-3 fatty acids can also be taken from fish consumed several times a week, mackerel, halibut, cod, salmon, sardines, or herring. But the use of dairy and cereal products, as well as eggs, in this case, it is better to minimize. Osteoarthritis destroys cartilage. It occurs more often in overweight people. In addition, extra pounds put a lot of stress on weakened joints. To get out of this vicious circle, you need to follow a diet to lose excess weight. Another common disease, gout, occurs due to metabolic disorders. Because of this, uric acid salts are deposited in the articular tissues, deforming the joints. A special diet for gout is the most difficult of all types of joint diseases. You will have to seriously limit your diet. Fatty meats and offal, confectionery and chocolate, fried and smoked, dried fruits, seafood, sorrel and spinach, cauliflower, legumes, sour berries, condiments and spices, ketchup and mustard, fatty sauces, salt, alcohol, strong tea and coffee. All these foods prevent the excretion of uric acid from the body, but it contributes to the speedy removal of abundant drinking throughout the day of clean water, weak tea, and fruit drinks. Also, do not forget about fractional nutrition. Throughout our lives, we load our joints every day. It is they who suffer primarily from various injuries and pathologies of bone tissues. Timely prevented destruction of the joints, the treatment of which can be extremely difficult, helps to maintain mobility for many years. To do this, it is extremely important to carefully monitor the condition of the cartilage and consult a doctor if symptoms appear that impede movement. It is important to understand what signs will indicate the approach of pathology and can significantly damage the motor apparatus. In this article, we will look at all the factors that can negatively affect the function of mobile connections. You will also find some tips to help you effectively deal with diseases and unpleasant pathologies. Common Symptoms of Joint Problems Damage to the junction of the bone can be single, for example, due to trauma. But the older a person becomes, the more he is disturbed by pain when bending his legs or arms and a decrease in flexibility in general. This happens because the normal production of cartilage tissue is inhibited. As a result, the friction force begins to destroy the bone, thereby bringing great discomfort. Symptoms of damage to the hip or knee joint are quite obvious. It is enough to pay attention to them to stop the destruction. The degenerative process in the movable junctions of the bones is indicated by pain and aches in the bones, especially when moving, creaking, crunching, and clicking in the places where the limbs are bent. Deformation and resizing of the junctions of bones, puffiness and hyperemia, difficulty in movement, chronic arthrosis, stiffness and muscle atrophy, which joints are most commonly affected. The most frequent destruction of the tissue of the joints occurs in large places of articulation, but they are not the only ones at risk. 1. Hip Joint here the problems are most often caused by age-related changes. Characterized by thinning of the cartilage layer, the fragility of bones, as well as congenital pathologies leading to injuries. 2. Kneecaps. This connection carries the most load. Discomfort and pain in the knees can be experienced by people of all ages. 3. Ankle and shoulder joints suffer in athletes and those who are engaged in heavy physical labor. 4. Brush elements. This part of the skeleton is prone to atrophy and arthritis in those whose work involves fine motor skills. 
Why do joints collapse? The source of joint disease can be both external causes and internal problems. If we discard age-related changes, there are still quite a few factors that can disrupt the normal functioning of the motor apparatus. First of all, these are professional and accidental injuries. They violate the integrity of bone structures and lead to various pathologies. It is also worth noting some inflammatory processes caused by fungi and viruses. Another reason for the destruction of the hip or knee joints is heredity. The inability of the body to regenerate cartilage normally can be inherited from the parents. Diagnosis of diseases of the joints of the legs. The question how to save joints is mostly asked by people after 30 years. However, it is worth thinking about health earlier in order to prevent the irreversibility of processes. To determine the presence of a problem and its source, it is necessary to conduct a comprehensive examination. It should include 1. X-ray, detects displacements and destruction in bones. 2. Ultrasound, with its help, it is easy to detect foci of inflammation and possible neoplasms. 3. CT and MRI, these procedures allow the most accurate assessment of the condition of the soft tissues surrounding the movable joint of the bones. Also, tomography allows you to diagnose the joints themselves. 4. Osteosintigraphy. Such an examination is carried out when there is a suspicion of a developed process of destruction. It allows you to identify foci of inflammation for their further elimination. 5. Arthroscopy. Allows using a microscopic camera to examine large compounds. Vitamins for joint pain. Calcium is responsible for the strength and durability of human bones. But in order for it to be retained in the body, it is also necessary to ensure sufficient levels of vitamin D3. At the same time, cartilage forms collagen. And for its sufficient generation, you also need to receive certain groups of vitamins. Vitamin A helps to absorb calcium and phosphorus and affects the internal processes that regularly renew the body. Vitamin E stabilizes lipids, strengthens ligaments, and provides sufficient flexibility. Vitamin C participation set in the active production of collagen and stimulates full-fledged immunity. Proper nutrition and diseases of the joints. The basis of the diet is foods rich in fiber and dietary fiber. Broccoli, oatmeal, whole grains, and bran are good. At least half of the daily intake should be fresh fruits and vegetables. What fruits are good for joints? Especially rich in anthocyanins, substances with anti-inflammatory properties. These include pomegranates, blueberries, strawberries, cherries, and strawberries. In diseases of the joints, in addition to a special diet, doctors recommend additional nutritional supplements. They are prescribed by a doctor depending on the diagnosis and nature of the disease. They are used in combination with a full course of treatment and are aimed at accelerating regeneration and reducing inflammation. Healthy Food for Joints Top 11 Products Number 1. Foods Rich in Selenium and Sulfur Selenium is an essential micronutrient for maintaining joint health. It is involved in their nutrition and hydration. Selenium is found in sufficient quantities in garlic, oatmeal, brown rice, and seaweed. Sulfur is the main substance for the production of collagen in the body. Chicken meat, eggs, chum salmon and cod, cereals, onions, all types of cabbage, and apples contain it in sufficient quantities. Number 2. Foods rich in boron and zinc. Zinc is another element that is involved in the regeneration of joints, in particular collagen fibers. Zinc is found in brown rice and meat. Boron is essential for strengthening bones. It can be obtained from cabbage, prunes, seafood, and nuts. Number 3. Calcium containing foods strengthen bones and joints. Calcium is the main building material of bones. There is a lot of it in cheeses, cottage cheese, eggs, nuts, and corn. Also found in beets, cabbage, artichokes, and seeds. In order for calcium to be better absorbed, it must be consumed with proteins. Number 4. Fish and foods rich in phosphorus. Sea and ocean fish are the main sources of phosphorus, which is involved in metabolic processes. Phosphorus is also found in cabbage and legumes. However, it is desirable to use them with herbs, parsley, cilantro, and lettuce. Number 5. Foods rich in vitamin D. Vitamin D helps strengthen joints. It can be obtained from foods such as cod liver, egg yolks, and butter. Number 6. Cereals, nuts, and sunflowers. Nuts and seeds are rich in vitamins and healthy fats. In particular, they are high in vitamin E sunflowers, nuts, flax seeds, and olive oil also contain vitamin F, which is essential for joints. Together with vitamin D, it helps calcium absorption. Number 7. B vitamins. Useful foods for joints, eggs, cheeses, bananas, and seafood. Number 8. Products with collagen and mucopolysaccharides. Mucopolysaccharides are building blocks for connective tissue. In their natural form, they are found in the cartilage and tendons of animals, fish, and birds, as well as in algae. Gelatin is extracted from them. 
Therefore, for the mobility and flexibility of the joints, it is recommended to prepare jellies from fish and poultry jelly, as well as fruit jelly, marmalade, and jelly. Redfish and kelp are natural sources of collagen. Number 9. Dried Fruits They contain many vitamins and microelements. However, you need to be careful with raisins. Number 10. Sources of Vitamin C Drinking Regimen Another principle of healthy nutrition for joints is clean water. An adult should drink 1.5 minus 2 liters of pure water daily, not counting coffee or tea and liquid food. This is very important because nutrients dissolve in water and are better absorbed. You need to drink in the morning, with any feeling of thirst, as well as half an hour or two hours after eating. It is advisable to drink in small portions, definitely before training, before physical activity. Water quality plays a key role. It is necessary to drink purified living water, that is, one that has not been boiled. Such water can be bought from trusted suppliers, filtered at home with special filters, or prepared as meltwater. Vitamin C plays an important role in collagen production. Most of it is found in citrus fruits, rose hips, black currants, and kiwi. We strive to make the world a better and healthier place. Write in the comments below, I am interested in what you think about it. On the channel, you can find many interesting and useful videos about the dangers and benefits of vegetables and fruits, as well as about diseases and how to treat them. So please subscribe to the channel and hit the bell so you don't miss new videos. We will be grateful if you share the video with your friends and like if you liked the video.